Hi guys, so this is a crazy stream of videos. I have five uploading currently and one that already uploaded. Um, tonight is the night where I could not sleep. It is now almost 4 a.m. I will let you know that I got like 11 hours of sleep last night and then I took two naps. So I'm just... I am tired, but I can't sleep. So, anyway, I thought I'd open up a Maya Rain Series 2. Um, I really wanted to open this doll next because her hair is driving me crazy. I know you can't see it as well. It looks so cheap. It literally looks like... It's the gel. It was what it is. I love this doll's makeup. I love everything about her. I even love her hair, just not in its current <laughs> uh, state. Hang on, let me just scoot you guys back a little bit. Okay. So, yeah, she's got her cheerleader outfit, which is... I guess what we're all calling it, because that's kind of what it is, but it's more like, Julia! <sighs> okay, I'm going to sleep after this. It's like cheerleader inspired, I say, having to be up in like two and a half hours. Um, cheerleader inspired, she has no pom-poms, the shoes are not really, I mean the cheer girl shoes are still heels, except I think jades, but you know, at least they lace up. Okay, so all I am doing is trying to wash this doll's hair. I am so ready to get this gel out. Ah, oh, hang on, let me show you. There's like hair literally plastered back here. She smells so chemically. Her hair is just... It's like I'm fighting it to like get it away from the back of the box. <laughs> um, they really, this is, this is worse than series one. Like I know we were all talking about series one. Bella was fine. I did not wash Bella's hair. Karma needed a wash, but um, it wasn't, it wasn't like this. This is just really... Really, really bad. Oh my god, did I just break her? Okay. No, I did not. She's okay. So I really... I mean, it's like a situation of, like, we were rooting for you. We were all rooting for you. I, oh, her nails are, like, almost like a super pale pink. Okay, I like that. Okay. Her pose in the box is just strange. Her, um, everything about this doll is, like, you gotta get her out of the box kind of deal. Like, she's not gonna look right in it. And then, of course, mine has a sideways dress. Because, why not? I'm gonna show you guys this hair. It's, like, literally hard to pull on. Like, to move out of the way. It's, like, difficult. It's so stiff. This is literally... I mean, like I said, this is worse than any series one doll. This is the worst gelled hair I've ever come across in all my years of collecting. 
so that's fun. That is a first. Um, I am really, really excited to get her open, though, because she's going to be so pretty. And she is um, out of this sort of... Okay, even, even her back part is somewhat gelled. I'm just... Why? Oh, she's strapped in by the legs, too. Okay. So, like I said, I love this one. Sh oh, hang on. I thought I said rainbow high on the plastic. I was about to be like, what the... <laughs> Honestly, that, like, give us less gel. You can save money, and we will love it. And all the boxes even say, like, wash it out. But, like, I understand wanting to make it look good in the box. But, like, this did not look good at all. Like, and I'm not trying to be nitpicky. It's just, um... really, really strange when, okay, okay, so this is what it looks like from the back, it's just, uh, really, really, really gelled, um, the back is okay-ish. If it was like this the whole way through, I could I could see it being okay. But um, this is a doll who I think is going to. I hate to say it. I don't know if she'll be a shelf warmer or not because I think a lot of little kids will like her because they won't care as much. But I think that, as far as collectors are concerned, that a lot of people won't, who are not completists, won't be rushing to get her, since so many people, for some reason, prefer Series 1 Amaya. And, um... Maybe I'll just pop it out of here. They have a really chemically smell this time around. Like, it's not that pleasant new doll smell. It's not. It's not necessarily unpleasant. It's just... Whoa. Okay. I'm going to stop complaining for a second. Because... No one has talked about this. The skirt is attached to the... Uh, Hang on, let me just free this. It smells like like it did when I got stitches when I was little, like seven. Like that's what it smells like. Like the something they put on me. So it's actually got like plush um folds that say R H all over them. Actually that's a really cool touch. But, um, yes, yeah, so do the, and the drawstrings actually work. Oh, hang on. It's actually two separate pieces. It's actually a cheer top and a hoodie. The hoodie is just plain. I'm not going to take them apart, but I didn't know that was going to be a thing. And then the socks, okay, the socks actually are complete. I thought they were, like, leg warmer style things, because why not at this point? Rainbow. Little rainbow sock. Rainbow in black and white, of course. I like that she's, like, a subtle rainbow doll. Like, she's not, like, crazy. Like, the hair is... If it was, like, the hair kind of, like, level the whole way down, I don't know how I would feel. Um, 
I love these shoes. I know a lot of people are complaining about the shoes. The shoes to me are the best part of her second outfit. I really do like the cheer theme. I just feel that it's kind of done halfway with her. Like, if they had given her pom-poms or if she's like chap captain of the cheer team, you know, that would make more sense. Maybe she is. We have not yet seen her on the show. Does anyone want to see Colin as a doll? I do. I think that he would make a really interesting looking doll. I would like to see him as a doll. And yeah, he was not a nice person, but that doesn't mean that, I mean, ultimately, we wouldn't care as much about the show if we cared about it at all, if it were not for the dolls. Her face is super shiny. Whoa, her head's like almost loose. So, oh, it's two pieces. What? What? Yeah, it's two pieces. Her head keeps wanting to flip around. Um, cool. Okay. Very nice. Definitely a lot of mix and match potential with this particular doll. Because you have the two, the two tops here, the skirt, the two tops there, the skirt, different shoes and socks. She does have the pierced ears, like everyone said, but does not come with earrings. Um, so look out for that. You're not going to be missing earrings, but she will have pierced ears. So if you like to give your dolls earrings, that's an awesome option. I think it would be cool if they all kind of came with that pierced ears, even if they didn't have earrings, and then like earrings and fashion packs. I don't know, that'd be kind of cool to me. Oh, I'm going to go wash out her hair. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.